be honest with you, this is a little freaky. It's the last time I did this was years ago and it was with uh, three other people, three other guys. I'm by myself right now and I have my little buddy. This is all BLM land right here and I'm trying to go slow right now to try to get that plume of dust to settle down a little bit. And there was also a fork in the road just back there. But I know full lead to Area 51. Area 51 is just right there. And the sun is so close to going down under the mountain. And I should be really close right now. guys there it is hope you can see it because I'm looking through the viewfinder and I can't even see it but I can see it with my eyes there's the two red signs all right guys right there I see the antenna right there. I don't know if you guys can hear all the birds chirping out here. It's really beautiful country out here. It's amazingly green out here. There's so many bugs. That's where the camo dudes usually show up is right on that road right there. Guess they're not going to. It's really crazy to think that just Area 51 is just right over there, Groom Lake. So it would be to the left right there. You would hit the top of Groom Lake and then right to the south of it would be all the runways and everything. most top secret base in the world. There's two antennas up there. One. Then. Is that it? Oh. Right there, two. So there's one. And two. That sun is so bright. I wish you'd just go down under the mountain. Which I know it's going to soon. Really beautiful out here. It's really hard to get to where you can actually read it. U.S. Air Force installation. No drone zone. Photography of this area is prohibited. Hmm, hmm, hmm. Wonder why they don't have a Lincoln County Sheriff come and give people like me a ticket for taking photographs and video. You know? I wonder what that does. I've seen that on so many videos before. <clears throat> Obviously, it tells the camo dudes if somebody's here. That is completely a camera. That, I know, is a camera. Right there. Look at that, oh yeah. It's just staring right at me. It's humming. So it's a generator right there. Somebody's gotta be fueling that every day. But you can actually see far into 51 right now. It's 
not far at all back there. Crazy. You guys, I've got a camo, dude. I can't believe it. Holy schmoly. He's been looking at me this whole time, and I can't see him because it's so dark. Are you kidding? Darn it. I can't see him through the camera. He's going to come over here and have a fit on me. It's just so dark. There, right there. There he is. Wait. See him? Right there. I got to keep putting my camera down to get it in focus. He was there the entire time. One more time. Okay. Guys, I don't believe it. That camo dude was there the entire time. I was there for about an hour. I could see, yeah, he's still right there. On the ledge of the mountain right there. I can't believe it. They do come out. He's just sitting right there. I don't know why this camera, it's got the weirdest focus. It'll focus once you bring it down to the ground. He's still up there on the ledge. I know I got him for you guys, but wow. Yep. I guarantee he heard everything I was saying because I kept saying while I had the camera off, gosh, camera dudes, you guys always mess with people, you know, that, you know, I don't know deserve it I didn't deserve anything I didn't even get within I think five feet of the gate you know so I flashed to my lights and everything but I turned around on a road because I seen another path going that way so going north so pretty much hugging the edge of area 51 uh, gate and when I turned off I see him sitting right up there and I'm like oh my goodness so I turned around and had to show you guys. I don't even know if he's still there. I'm gonna have to get out and look one more time. This is so crazy. I don't want him to think that I'm trying to start trouble though. I definitely don't want that. I wouldn't be able to see him. Even if I wanted to see how weird this is now look it'll come into focus. Oh, no, he's still there He's right up Ah, here This is He's gonna be right on top of the ridge right there Yeah, right there. He's focused good right now Just sitting there Back into focus, you guys see him? Finger's gonna look huge. Can't get my finger in there. Oh well, you guys can see him right up there on the perch. Right there. And there he is. I got him. He's still there. There's always two of them in the car at the same time. How cool. How neat is that? Now I gotta go right back down this road. Look at the lights already shining on there. Where are they? It's beautiful out here, you guys. I never knew it was actually this beautiful this time of the year. It's always brown when I drive through here. When I did come out with my friends, that was in the 90s. That was when this base wasn't even acknowledged yet as being an Air Force Base. I think when I came out with my three friends, I believe that was 1994. We came out the same exact road. I was so young at that time, guys. You know, I still remember it very well, but you know, I don't remember, you know, all this and everything. I remember seeing the fence. I mean, that was actually. Gosh, did I even have a cell phone at that time? I'm not even sure. I don't think I did. 1994. I don't even think I had a cell phone at that time. I think people are still carrying around those bricks for phones. I hope you guys enjoyed that. I really did. That was the mountain range that you could 
in the 90s, and obviously before that, the 90s is when people would go up there and actually look over to Area 51. But since then, the government's annexed all that. So that's all Area 51 as well, too, or Nellis Bombing Range. <clears throat> so the nearest peak you can go to right now is Tickaboo Peak, which is almost like Peekaboo Peak, but it's way over there, okay? So you gotta have such a high strength camera, because Area 51 is really, even though we came up the road right here, it's really right out there, okay? Out that way. So the dry lake would be here, then the runway and everything would be out there. And then S4 would be another eight miles out this way. That's where Bob Lazar said that mountain was with the nine hangers, I believe. So at Tickaboo Peak, you can get all the way to the top and look. And you, I've seen videos of it. It's just terrible footage. People bring their drones up there. And of course, drones, I don't know why they don't put zoom on them, but they don't. All right, guys, one more shot of the front entrance road to Area 51. All right, guys, look how dark it is now. That's all my lights lighting up. But there's somebody coming up from behind me. This is going back to Highway 375. You guys can see that light here. Look in my rear view mirror. See the light right there? Right there. Somebody's coming after me. They're getting closer. Seems like they stopped. No, they're getting closer. Yep. Yeah, they're coming. So hard to tell. This is such a long road. I think I'm gonna perch out here for a little bit and see if they pass me. Wow, what is that? Now I can't. S I can. The light is gone, but I can see a little bit of residue through the dust. Did they just cut their lights off and I see their truck? I don't know. Oh, let's see. Okay. Take my seatbelt off here. Oh yeah, there's someone definitely back there. Yep, see the dust plume? Who is that coming? There was a light on 375 up there. I take off, they'll take off. All right, guys, see if I can get them to follow me. Which they are. I could completely see that dust plume. Look, I think they're driving without their lights on right now. It's so crazy. It's like they're moving at like three miles per hour or something. Oh, they're definitely closer. Yeah, I, oh, the truck's right there, I think. Uh, yeah, see ya. Yeah. Yeah. That is a definite truck. Can you see it? They're moving really slow. 
comes one car on the 375. See the light right there? Oh yeah, that's a truck. It's right there. Oh my gosh, am I really going to have a camo dude right on me? Yeah, that is a truck. Oh my gosh, they have their lights off. This is about to get scary. Oh, this is about to get really scary. Oh my gosh, yeah, I'm out of here. Yeah, they're right behind me, you guys. See that? They are right behind me. Oh my goodness. And their lights are off. Gosh, this is like complete ET stuff here. Like right on my tail. Look at that. I don't want to start dusting them out. They are driving with absolutely no headlights on. Look at this. got a light on now. I don't know if it's a cab light, a reverse light, or a, it's a red light. What are they doing? They're just making sure I get out of here. I don't want to step on my brakes either. I don't know if they turned around or not. Now they were right on me. I think they turned around. I think they were right on me. It's so dark right now, guys, that I can't really tell. They turned around. But they're just waiting there, I don't know. There's a light right there. Right there, there they go. They're right there. Look. Yep, there they go driving. They're sneaky. They either, oh, there they are. Wow. I wonder where they're gonna go. How crazy. I know this isn't the most interesting video, so I'm not gonna stay on them guys, but wow. Maybe I should have stopped and let them pass me. You guys see him right there? Right there. Alright guys, it's about a half hour later than when I shot before when they were following me. But there's now two camo dudes. There's one. This is looking back towards the base. Yeah, you can see his light right there. Right there, and I'm not zoomed in. So that's him right there by the base. And then, also going closer to the base, he keeps flickering off and on. Right there. 
that light right there. That one keeps coming closer. Now it looks like he just turned off his light. No, there it is. Both seem to be coming closer. I have seen videos where they just roll up on you. This guy's definitely coming closer. It's getting really cold out here. Sorry about the wind, you guys. Get behind the Jeep. There we go. Yeah, I got the Jeep running. Just in case. You can tell they're both moving. The guy out there, he's definitely moving towards me. And look how much closer he is. That light is dead on me. Huh. Yeah, this guy's moving fast right now. Yeah, he's moving really quick. He keeps going past trees and everything. They're both coming in. Alright, I'll start it if uh, they come closer. 